Oh, it's time. Smackdown Live. The pay-per-view. Elimination Chamber. Are we on good terms now, Nikki? No, you're still angry with me. You have a stupid size to make the... Okay, you're gonna say the exact same thing you said last time. Never mind, then. But that's it. It is the tiebreaker today. The final match. See who will win the best of five series out of me and Dolph Ziggler for here at Elimination Chamber. And we've got to prove that we can do it. Because if we don't, well, that won't be very good work. Sebastian Cole is also here. Does he have a match tonight? Hey. You're in this thing, man. You have Dolph Ziggler rattle. Take advantage and get that win. Thank you, Sebastian Cole. How about you, Aiden English? Well, well, well. If it isn't the up-and-comer himself, I bet you think you're hot stuff right now. That's good. But if you if you ever cross me, all that heat is going to fade away when I lay you out on ice. Don't make me warn you again. Aiden English, you can hold a candle to me. Alright, quick, quickly do my, I can't do my stats, never mind. No WWE Champion, still, is it AJ? It's me versus Dolph. I'll check the match card instead, actually, because I want to see if the entire match is else. Uh, American Alpha versus the Usos. Uh, and there's a six-man elimination match for the United States Championship, including... Four Cruiserweights, Shinsuke Nakamura, and Chris Jericho. Huh. I thought all the Cruiserweights would be on, um... Raw. Well, I guess they're on SmackDown. Okay. Just... Just got out of the producers' meeting. Kinda heated. But some... But good heart... He, good heat. Heated, I think. Alright. I wanna reiterate that you already know because... I love to beat a dead horse. You wouldn't be a producer otherwise. Hey now, I rag on myself. Doesn't mean you get to. Pump up the WWE Universe. We've got to make Elimination Chamber hotter than hot. First match is you, so it all falls down on your shoulders. Get out there and be you. That's all they want. And that's what gets you the win. Make it a freestyle match. Let's go. And it's here. Elimination Chamber. Dolph Ziggler's the first to come out. So I'm going to skip the entrance. <laughs> and of course, I've still got The Rock at my corner to make sure I have the win that I deserve. The Crimson King is here, and I'm with The Rock, so let's go, let's win, let's beat Dolph Ziggler at Elimination Chamber. Ha-bam! Ha-bam! Alright, let's go. Oh. 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 Oh, okay. Oh yeah, I went for the power bomb. Nah, that's not gonna happen. Fuck. Ah. Oh, okay. And just let me get up to revert. Let me reverse another one of his moves. Nope. Bam. Drop hole. Bam. Easy. Kick him in the foot. Kick him in the foot. Oh no. Irish whip. Uh, oh. And a drop kick to the face. And I want to kick him in the chest. Because I don't want to head trapped. Fame. Ow. Oh, fuck. Ow. Ah, no you don't, Dolphin. 
Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Fuck. Alright, rolling out. Smart move. Take some time to think things over. Dolph Ziggler's talent is second to none. The man goes out there to have the best match on the card every single night. And the term show off is more than just a moniker. For Ziggler, it's okay. a way of life. I'll be the first to admit it. Dolph Ziggler is charismatic. He's a tremendous No, 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 no. Alright, too far. DDT. Sounds a lot like me. I can tell you, Cole, that's a bird. Ow. That was stiff. Why have my why is my reversal timing so off? Jesus. I didn't even see the reversal thing, I just pressed the button. BAM. Alright. Come on, we haven't got too long on this. Uh, do okay. Another drill break. Okay, let's wait for you to get up. Fair enough. Let's do it. Uh, bam, stunner. Yeah. All right, get up and. Crossbody! Boom! Alright, let's not. Come on, back in the ring. You there, look, there you go. Bam! Come on. We're gonna win this best of five series it's still 4-4 four four at the moment of course um oh yeah no oh um what's stopping me from getting in the ring hello bye okay you know what let's get behind it nope Fast, yep. Just being no. Ah, oh, fuck. One. A two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Okay, cool. That should do it. That was both a quick and powerful. Aha! Uh -huh. No! Harkarana! Boom! <sighs> Alright, up you get. Come on. Hit it. Yeah, we hit it. Bend to the knee. Let's go. Okay. Maybe the stamina come back. Oh. I lost all my charge for it. I'm drop kicking. Alright. Let my stamina come back. Okay. I'll let the stamina come back. Tell him off. Tell him off. Okay. Come on, Dolph. There we are. Time for the cutoff. Bada boom. Ah, Alright. And we just pin him, and we get on the wall there. One, two, three. We have won here at Elimination Chamber. Three-star match, just like they wanted. And just like that, the Crimson King wins with the rock by his side. Thanks to The Rock, watching my back, we fucking won. Let's go. Let's go. You know what? We're not done here yet. Don't forget, we fucking cheated. First two matches. So if anything, 
He deserves a little more. Bend to the knee. Bam. And finally, he deserves a cutoff. And just like that, we call it. That's how you use your power to your advantage. <laughs> and we've got a nice thumbnail. Awesome. Yeah, we won. Woo! What a match. That's how you start off the pay-per-view. Why I wouldn't be so I wouldn't be surprised if you stole the whole show. I guess you got that free, that free two big pay per view comeback finale you wanted. I have no idea what you're talking about. Ah, hey man, what a compelling conclusion. Tell you what, I'm gonna go the go ahead and give you the weekend off, but it's Sunday. Really? Saturday and Sunday. You're welcome. But it is Sunday. Have a good one. We'll see. Alright, I'll see him Tuesday. I mean, it's Sunday now. Why do I get Monday? In... Let's go speak with The Rock then. The crowd was loving you. In fact, they were so engrossed, they didn't know that The Rock had the best seat in the house. What the rock saw was nothing short of amazing. You're one of a kind. Not electrifying yet, but definitely some good sparks. Keep working your skill, keep training your body, keep refining your promos. With that compliment, you're going to become one of the top guys here. Can I buy you a drink? It's the least I owe you after everything. Hey, you don't own the rock anything. Besides, it isn't a cheat day yet. And when that when the rock says day, he means day. The rock will take you up on that offer then. And you'll probably regret it. <laughs> the people's eye will be on you and the rock will be around every now and then. Until then, keep keep on keeping on. Good night, Rock. Later my man. And just like that, I'm friends with The Rock. I'm gonna buy him a cold one. A cold one with The Rock. Amazing. And I'll see you on SmackDown, I guess, then. After I go speak to Sebastian Cole. Hey. I can't believe you actually pulled it off. You definitely staked your claim to a title with a match like that. Thank you. And there's nobody in the office. So it's just enough. Wait, is that Kane? Didn't he return at TLC? He's on SmackDown. Yeah, that was a lot of time you were seen. Let's go talk to Kane. Hey, don't forget about me when you're hoisting that championship one day. I believe in you. From, I believed in you from the start. Thanks, Kane. Do we have a new champion? Or any new champions? Maybe we'll find out because we've only we're the only start we're only the starter. So let's get home. And next week on SmackDown. Double the day you've got the comics. 2019, March, week one, SmackDown Live. We want to go speak to Todd Millen in the production area. Hello, Kirkzor. Hey, man. I'm glad to see you. I think we're two of the very best the WWE has to offer, so I was thinking we could have a match. It'd be a lot of fun. I'm a big fan of yours. Well, thanks. I was thinking uh, for up to the and let's have a great match. A match that the media would give four stars. 
Think you can beat me in a match that good? Hell, I'll take you. I'll take you up on it. We'll put on the best show before my win. I like the way you think. But I'm going to be the one who's going to win. Current week one, total weeks one. Get a four star match and we get 40 influence and money. Except for the side quest, the side quest will begin on this week's show. Alright, sweet. It's Ross Crimson versus Akira Tozawa next week on SmackDown. Which is awesome. It said influence, didn't it? Um. Yeah, I'd say I need some influence. <laughs> oh, almost got that promo star. Allows you to get buffs. And I've almost got the runnings on the mind. Let me get that in there. You know. Alright, nobody lost any titles last night. But a shirt sales. Oh, low. So. I'll change that off camera. No, wait. Oh, I'll just do it. Yeah, I'll just change it off camera. After we go speak to Renee. Hello, Renee. Give this a promo. What have you been doing to prepare for tonight's match? I don't need to prepare. I already know everything I need to know about this guy. And what he tried to do. What you'll try and do. When that bell rings, I know him better than he knows himself. This guy doesn't know it yet, but he's already lost. The pinfall is just a forma formality at this point. How would you rank yourself in the history of pro wrestling? Are you kidding? You must be kidding. Is that even a question? <laughs> I'm obviously the greatest. Listen to the people. They'll tell you everything you need to know. There'll never be another superstar quite like me. Alright, cool. You have now unlocked Company Man, level 1. Hey, we got it. Cool. Cool. Alright, let's go talk to... Let's go speak to Todd Millen then. Wait. Is that... Bray Wyatt? What's he doing on SmackDown? Isn't he a raw guy? Do you do this for the t-shirts, for the paychecks, for the ad, for the adoration? Why do you do this? What motivates you? These are the questions that must be answered whether you choose to embark on a legendary WWE career. Yeah, I know. Uh, Shane O'Mac, can I speak to you please? Honestly, I'm kind... To be honest, you're being very pesky right now. Don't make me trade you for Raw. That is rude, and you know what? M maybe I'll go back to Raw. You never know. Is Daniel in the uh, locker room? No, just Baron Corbin. Hey, Baron Corbin, you got my back then? Yeah, you're, you're saying the exact same thing. Okay, cool. Alright. Go speak to Todd Millen. You match card. Have I got a match tonight? TJP. Uh, Randy Orton versus Grand Metalik. The Usos versus Ascension. Okay. You ready for this? Tonight's a good chance to get some momentum. Alright, cool. Check the match card. What match do I have? A match against Jack Gallagher. Let's go. And I can't do anything else. So I'm fighting the cruiserweights. Here we are on SmackDown Live. With a match against Jack Gallagher. One of the cruiser... One member of the cruiserweight division. Or... I mean, the cruiserweight division is kind of non-existent here. But, you know... We'll see. So here I come to the ring. The Crimson King looking to just beat Jack Gallagher in a nice match of British person versus British person, I guess. Jack Gallagher. Here he comes with William 
The third. Jack Gallagher. This is a great way to spread the word about the effects of tobacco use, folks. They have links to a lot of eye-opening articles from around the world. I highly recommend. Just look at that mustache. So good. All right. Ross Crimson. Jack Gallagher. Let's go. See if we can lock up nicely. There we are. There we go. Headlock. Okay. I can work that. Alright. Push him off. Buttons there. Alright. Dodge. Buttons there. Oh. Over the top. There we are. There we go. Nicely done. Alright. Let him get back up. Let's go. Oh. Oh no. 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 Wins or not. Um. No, oh, no, he's gonna kick me in the king. Ah, oh, he kicked me in the king. How could he do that? The bam. Nice try, Gallagher. But it's my turn now. Ha, bam. Oh, drop kick. Okay. Let's get you on the ropes. And we're gonna do the backdrop. Bang! That's not the way you want things to go down. Literally. Okay. Bang. Come on, Jack. Bang. Give him a nasty chop. Ah, fuck. All right. Whoa. Fair enough. Let's go. Bang. Grab his leg. That's it. We're gonna get. Huh? Bam! He's a bit off his game here. He's gonna want to make sure this doesn't right. snowball out of control. To the corner. Let's get him up. Come on. Come on, Jack. Give me a fight. Bam! Oh fuck! There we go. Bad move there. Whoa! I don't know Almost got me. In the corner you go. Up you go. Time for a superplex, I think. Bam. Alright, here we go. Hup! Bam! You see this guy? He's losing. Hey! Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Hey! No, fuck. Aha, you thought you could do it to me? No, no you can't. Get belly to belly overhead suplex. I think I can, think I can do it to Jack Gallagher. Aha. Alright, come on. No, no, no. Alright, in you go. And German. Alright. In the back in the corner he should go. In you go. Alright. Oh fuck. Nope. Okay. He's in control. Nope, it's too slow. Okay. I am. I fully expect him to bounce back though. This is the type of one on one atmosphere where he thrives. He's doing exactly what he didn't want to do here. He's letting his opponent right back into this match. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh no. Oh, what a neck breaker. My head is not doing the best. 
Oh fuck, one of his signature headbutts. Alright. Nah! Alright, I'm fine. I am fine. No. Now he's gotta capitalize. Okay. Come on. Oh, yes! Kicked out. Okay, I took that one. Alright. I found it. Alright, come on, Gallagher. We got this. Bam. Bam. Come on. We've got to bend to the knee now. Bam. You're British. You know what it's like to know what rope. You know what it's like to have a monarchy. You should know what it's like to bend the knee. And I'm sorry, but it's time for you to get cut off. Bam. And just like that. I think it's time to end this. One, two, three. Just like that, and the Crimson King is the winner. Defeating Jack Gallagher. Although Jack Gallagher put up a fight, he was no match for the Crimson King here on SmackDown Live. Let's well I'll set the match again. Okay. Let's get the arena by talking to the thingy. Alright, cool. It's literally Alright, every time the story is finished, it kinda goes into like this weird, oh do this, do that type of thing. Where nothing exactly happens. So you just kind of don't really do anything, just kind of get on with it until you get to the next bit of story. Which is kind of what I'm doing right now. But I am going to end the episode off here. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next week on SmackDown and next time on WWE 2K18. Goodbye.